We get asked by our customers all the time, what's the difference between a dual beam bulb and a single beam bulb? Is a 9005 single or dual? Is an H13 single or dual? Do I need a dual beam LED if I have a dual beam halogen? And is the headlight dual beam or the bulb? In this video, we're gonna answer all those questions. When you're trying to pick out the right light bulb for your application, a lot of times it comes up, which type of bulb, single beam or dual beam? The most important thing to remember is the single beam or dual beam is referring to how many filaments are inside your light bulb, not the headlights. So this headlight housing uses a dual beam light bulb. This headlight housing uses two single beam light bulbs. I know that's kind of confusing. The single beam headlight has two light bulbs, the dual beam headlight has one light bulb, but it all comes down to the light bulb, not the housing. For example, this is an H13 halogen incandescent light bulb, extremely common in different Ford applications and uh, even the Jeep Wrangler. This one light bulb has two filaments, dual beam. This thing does low beam and high beam, based on which filament or filaments are illuminated. Now, if we go to this bulb, a 9006, one of the most common single beam, low beam bulbs, it has one filament, one filament, single beam. So if you were to take your dual beam halogen bulb and put it in a headlight, you're gonna see that you have one big reflector and inside it has one light bulb with two filaments. This one light bulb does both high and low beam. This is a dual beam headlight bulb and the one large reflector makes it a dual beam housing. If you were to take your single filament, single beam light bulb and put it in something like this one, you're actually gonna need two bulbs. The low beam is gonna be one of the reflectors and the high beam is gonna be the other reflector. So even though it takes two light bulbs, this is a single beam housing because each light bulb creates one beam, low beam or high beam. When you get into HID bulbs, they do things a little bit different. So as you can see, here's a single beam HID. You can see the capsule inside with the electrodes and the xenon gas. When it illuminates, it stays at a constant rate of power. It doesn't change intensity. It doesn't illuminate more or less. It doesn't start another light output source. It just stays put all the time, just like its halogen bulb counterpart. The HID bulb has one ball of gas with electrodes. It's called a capsule. And the single beam halogen bulb has one filament. When you go to a dual beam HID bulb, again, we have one capsule inside, just like the single beam bulb. But the big difference is, through a relay harness and electromagnet, this bulb moves. When it's close to the reflector, when it's energized and the bulb is sucked in, it's closer to the reflector and creates a beam pattern that shines higher up in the air. It's not necessarily any more bright, but it changes position from a low beam pattern to a high beam pattern. And when it's de-energized and all the way out, it creates your low beam because the light source moves further away from the reflector center. So it's just like this halogen bulb. You see how it has two filaments. One of them is close to the center where it mounts and one of them is farther away. So just like when the low beam ignites, it's one filament, the high beam ignites and it's a different filament. Because they're at different spacing inside the halogen bulb, it creates a different beam pattern. The last technology that we're gonna talk about is LED headlight bulbs. Just because it's a different technology doesn't mean they don't have to play by the same rules. With a single beam halogen bulb, we still need a single beam LED. With a dual beam halogen bulb, we still need a dual beam LED. Now, if you get an H13 halogen bulb, you also need the matching dual beam H13 LED. Same thing if you had an H4 dual beam bulb. You need the H4 counterpart in HID or LED, whatever you're choosing. That's why you might be kind of confused. When you think dual beam, you might think two bulbs. 
Dual beam is one bulb with two filaments. Single beam is one bulb with one filament. Remember, it's about the bulbs, not the housing. I don't want you to watch this video and say, oh, I've got a single beam bulb. I better go buy a single beam LED headlight bulb. That's not how it works. You have to figure out which light bulb type you have, 9005, 9006, H13, H4, etc. This video is simply to describe the difference in style between single beam and dual beam. You might have an H13 and find out you have a dual beam. You might have an H11 and find out you have a single beam. That's all we're talking about. If you need help figuring out which bulbs fit your vehicle, please email us, sales at headlightrevolution.com or go to our website and call us. Thanks a lot for watching and subscribe if you want to learn more about lighting technology.